Okay, 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 okay. okay. Thank you. Boys, come here, please. Bobby's usually fine because he doesn't sit there and go. He'll sit there and stare. PJ's like, hi, Mama. What are you doing? Hi, Mama. What are you doing? Mom. Okay, I'm so. Mama. Come. Mama. Come. 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 Just a minute, please. Can Mama. Daddy can come help you in a minute. Dad. Contouring. Hi, Beth. Thank you, you, for saying that, Sarah. It's annoying to me. <laughs> Hi, Beth, 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 how are you? Okay, so contouring with Brave in palette four. So across the forehead, down the cheek a little bit. And I'm just gonna go back. And then across the chin, the bottom of the chin. And we'll go back to this brush. Hi, whoever the third person is that's on and watching. I always have a couple of elusive people, but you blend it in because we don't want any makeup lines. Makeup lines are not pretty. And hi, whoever just out, who else has hopped on and watching. My four viewers. But blend it in so good that you don't have a makeup line. So I go underneath my chin. Oh, thank you, cute. Thanks, you're too kind, Sarah. <laughs> I do do this every day, but most of the time he can, like, I don't know. Hotel rooms do something different for kids. They're not always mesmerized by the hotel rooms. Okay. So... I am going to go back to Addiction Palette 4. Beth, you have a good day too. And I'm going to go ahead and use Brave for my eyebrows. Addiction Palette 5, and I'm going to go ahead and mix her casting with Victoria's again. I really liked that. from palette five today but we're gonna finish off the eyebrows um again i actually just had the eyebrow pencil we have the eyebrow pencil and the eyebrow gel the eyebrow pencil and gel come in three colors light medium and dark i of course use dark and that's why um the colors from palette four work really well um because they're a dark enough brown that they work pretty well so in case you can't have the brow pencil that's what i started doing was using palette four and well come get his toothbrush get it wet and then out of my way please Baby, but I know this one. Thank you. Um, 
Sorry. Sissy has the toothpaste. Okay, so I'm gonna look for my I'm gonna look for white. So I'm gonna do look our pristine. Pristine in my waterline. There's the other one I wanted. It was our purple. this morning there we go so pristine in my waterline so she has the toothpaste page you can go get it from her but make sure you get a good coat of it in the waterline and that'll help you want to make sure you get it in there really really good so it helps a wet on the eyeliner from a few um silver all over I'm gonna go ahead and do I'm gonna go and do Suspicious from Palette 5, which is this one here. and do up top here we're gonna do vintage under the eyebrow concentrating I apologize not much action going on because of the early hour of the morning um apologize but get those get the colors blended now I'm gonna go and do sarcastic for the crease which is this one right here it was one of the ones I used for my blush. So crease line gets sarcastic. Then for the corners, I'm going to go ahead and use Victorious, which was the other one that I used to for my blush. You want some toothpaste on it. 
I'm gonna go back to doing my eyeliner and this is in the color of pur purposeful this is one of our three items that um there we go okay hope that hope people can see um that reconnected we'll see that, that hopefully that'll last but now I'm gonna go ahead and do I'm gonna do a little bit of sarcastic underneath um, just down here and a little bit of fearless underneath the eye just to be a little bit more fun and a little bit different and these are both from palette 5 um, victorious it's that pink one that I just put on and then there's Fearless, which is this purple, and we're gonna go, I'm gonna go underneath of that one too, just a tiny bit. I don't want to go too crazy. There we go. Just something a little different. I'm learning fun little new tricks and tips and whatnot. It's a lot of fun. Um, Mama, excuse me. Um, excuse me yourself, you old pongo. He's rinsing off his toothbrush. Such a good boy. Do you need a little bit of help? Okay. Okay, you gotta hop down so I can finish. Good job. Here, just stick it down. There you go. Voila. Can you please hop down? It's good, Joe. Dude. Yeah. Okay, excuse me. Hop down, please. Can you PJ? Good boy, PJ. So now it's time for the 3D fiber mascara. And, um,. So it's gel and then fiber, and then gel and then fiber, and then you seal it with gel. You can do it on the bottom if you want, on your bottom eyelashes if you want, or you don't have to. I typically do it on my back, like one layer on my lash, on my bottom lash. So you're gonna wanna coat your eyelash the one you're working on and you're going to want to coat it really good so the fibers have some place to stick and I will f and all those little things right there all the little skips and whatever from the mascara that cleans up really nicely with q-tips and we're going to get in here and get oops get the corners here I'm gonna get it really good here. There we go. And close that. And we're gonna go ahead and do our fibers. Get those fibers to lay down just a tiny bit. Oops, that's what. Forgot that bottom lash of mine over here. Silly. This is why on a regular Sunday, um,. It doesn't get done so early. So lay those fibers down, flatten them on the back of your hand, and then you put them on your lashes. And you get those sticking really good. So. And then you go to the other eye. You want to make sure that that one gets coated really well with the gel. Coat those lashes really well with the gel. And 
Remember to swirl instead of pump. Pumping makes air get in there. The air dries it out. And you really don't want that with this stuff. This stuff is worth what you pay, but it's a lot of money. So you don't want to, to go to waste because it dries out. That stinks. So we're just gonna finish up this eye and then I will do my lips on the way to church. Now I'm gonna go ahead and seal. I'm gonna go ahead and seal my fibers. So, seal those fibers on their eyes. Whoop. And then I will get a Q-tip and clean up. And I hope everybody's gonna have a great Sunday. Um, here we go. So that's fabulous. Um, for time purposes, I'm gonna end right here. Say have a good, have a great Sunday. Um, we'll see you again tomorrow morning. It won't be as rushed. We'll get up and we'll get going. Um, because we're just, we're gonna be traveling home. Um, so it might be on the earlier side tomorrow too, but we'll see um, what time everybody gets going and stuff. Um, but hope everybody has a wonderful Sunday. If anybody has any questions, please feel free to ask. Um, and I will get back to you. Have a great day.